finally get to film the trains close up on the trains on Highway 301 in Wildwood kind of stirs the imagination here the stationary trains on Highway 301 a lot of uh, graffiti on the trains kind of just Kind of just stirs the imagination. The stationary trains on Highway 301 in Wildwood. Hello, YouTube friends. This is Richard Baby with Richard Baby Presents. I'm with my sister Patty, and we're just having a great Saturday early afternoon here. Uh, um, we're, we're in Wildwood. We're on our way to um, Nick's train store on Main Street in Wildwood and I thank my sister Patty for driving so we're gonna check out I'm gonna check out Nick's trains uh, he's only been open for about a month or so so have a little fun and uh, check out uh, the interior of Nick's the proper name is Nick's vintage trains on Main Street aka Highway 301 in Wildwood so without further ado here we go. So YouTube friends, I'm at Nick's Vintage Trains and uh, right on Highway 301 in Wildwood, in the, uh, the main street of Wildwood. So let's just take a little tour of Nick's Vintage Trains. Now we got uh, the showcases, beautiful showcases here. And uh, Here's uh, some complete sets here. Here's a beautiful complete set here. Give you an idea here. This is, um, uh, I guess the uh, selling price for most people want is $499.99 and on sale at Nick's at $469.99. That's uh, the Polar Express. So they got some, he's got a nice collection of finished sets here. And uh, beautiful showcases here, and uh, a lot of the uh, the old trains. And my dad had a lot of old trains, and uh, we sold them before he passed away. But this brings back a lot of memories. Beautiful showcases here, and uh, there's the city people. Remember it well, the old. Uh, Pennsylvania barn, fifty dollars. That's a good price for that. Um, it's not bad. A whole array of people for twenty dollars, nineteen dollars. Oh, the old shell, old school gasoline. Beautiful. Quite a few of the. It's uh, thirty dollars for the, for the shell tanker that's not bad not bad at all some more woodland scenic scenes give you that oh that's a beautiful one not bad 175 beautiful showcases here absolutely beautiful showcases here and uh, I had this train when I was a kid that had this very same train right here and I remember I had this very same caboose at $15. That's a good deal. So uh, a lot of the old, old, old. And he's even got a jigsaw puzzle here. A little bit of everything. See, going along here. You see the showcases are just absolutely beautiful here. There's a, a four-piece set at $175. That's a good price. These. These are uh, these are very old. Oh, nice array of books here. Lionel. My dad had the Lionel trains. This is uh, stamps here. Some more uh, Lionel. 
product. And I like this old school here. Got the, uh, the boy there with his Lionel trains. Lionel had uh, great, great, great graphics. Lionel since 1924. And uh, oh, beautiful, the old school engines. Not bad, $150. That's not a bad price for that. The old, remember these well, underneath the Christmas tree, the Transformers. Nice setup here. Everything is so organized, and the, you can see the showcases are just beautiful here. And uh, there's 125. Really, really nice stuff here. And uh, Nick was nice enough to allow me to do a tour of the of his store. I think he's been uh, been here for a little over a month. Some nice. Uh, the, I remember these figurines. My dad had a lot of those for his set. And uh, beautiful. Oh, I love these little, the old school cars and trucks. My dad had an entire array of them. Beautiful. Oh, there's a train track in, in progress here. So I'll just take a scan of the whole store here. Beautiful setup here. And uh, the cabinets are beautiful, very spacious. Uh, Nick's trains on Main Street in uh, Wildwood. You can stop by and say hello to Nick and uh, check this all out. Beautiful, beautiful setup here. So YouTube friends, that's gonna wrap it up for this episode of Richard Maybe Presents. Uh, I thank Nick for letting me do a tour of his new store, uh, properly named Nick's Vintage Trains. Uh, thank my sister Patty for driving, appreciate it very much. And hope you enjoyed this episode. Um, new business in town in Wildwood. Uh, I think Nick said he's been here, been open for about six weeks. So um, if you're in Wildwood, the Villages area, Central Florida, stop by and see Nick and then check out his uh, the trains he's got for sale. Uh, and a very nice man. And, um, you know, get some good deals on some trains. Uh, so. Uh, without further ado, I'll close. Stay healthy, stay happy, stay, um, stay, stay positive. This is Richard Maybe, signing off.